Browns era. I do. Let's Facts. get to the I NFC do. East Facts. now. Redskins rookie quarterback Dwayne Haskins battling for the starting gig in Washington. Yesterday, the Redskins released their 2019 unofficial quarterback depth chart. Take a look at this. Say what? Oh. Haskins. He did what? Hey. String. <laughs> Colt McCoy is the QB1. Case Keenum is QB2. Oh, we messed up another graphic. Jay Gruden addressed his quarterback situation just <laughs> yesterday. Colt, you know, he's got the most experience in the system, but he still hasn't played a whole lot. You know, he hasn't taken a lot of reps. Last year was all about Alex. The year before that was, you know, about Kirk and, and uh, getting them ready. So he's never really worked with a starting team a whole lot. You know, he only played about a game and a half last year, and he never got reps to get ready for that one because it was a short week, and, and then he got hurt. Uh, so, you know, we got to get him more reps. And Case has all the reps, but he doesn't have much experience in the system. He's uh, doing a nice job, and obviously Dwayne's a rookie. So uh, all three of them have shown Flashes of being uh, really good, really productive, and all three of them have shown flashes of, hey, we got to get better. You okay, buddy? Yeah, I'm good, Kay. I, I don't want people to get my enthusiasm for Dwayne Haskins, Haskins misunderstood um, or even a slight towards Colt McCoy or Case Keenum. I do feel like the young fella, throw him out there right now, you'll get a similar result that we got with Lamar Jackson and Baker Mayfield last season. But just like any other rookie, you got to go out there and earn it. You got to start from the bottom and you got to climb your way up. My son, Little Nate, is starting freshman football. Mm -hmm. And as much as I think he's talented and he's a skilled athlete and I want him to be a starter on both sides of the ball, I told him he's going to have to earn it. Mm -hmm. You're young. You can't look at a, a sophomore or a junior or even a senior and even sniff at their position until you prove to your teammates, your coaches, that you can handle the workload. And I think it's the same thing with Dwayne Haskins. Mm -hmm. Prove to your teammates, your coaches, that you can handle the workload and then go steal that starting position. But right now, credit to Colt and credit to Case. Well, look, the incentive for the Redskins is to start Dwayne Haskins because he's going to put – Butts in the seats, and he'll sell jerseys. And, but, you know, for Jay Gruden, it's okay. At the same point, I'll only put him in there if he's ready. I don't think an August depth chart matters, but I do think that they're not going to just throw him out there before – Russell Wilson was ready. I think Kyler Murray is ready. Like, some of these guys come in after being starters, and they're right. just ready to be polished, and they can go in the offense. Yeah. Clearly, Colt McCoy is ready. He's been in Jay Gruden's offense for over three decades. Now you've got Dwayne Haskins, who's in there for three months, and he's trying to learn it. So I'd like to see what it is at September 5th. Not necessarily right now. But if Haskins was blowing them away, he'd be number one. If he's so third, is there an indictment, then, if he is third? And maybe. the front office wants to sell tickets, and they still have him third on the desk or behind maybe. them? Here's how, if, if he's the third, and he doesn't get the spot, whatever, because he's not good enough, that's fine. What I always think is very dangerous is predetermining. Sure. Like, we're not starting the rookie. We look at the Browns last year. They weren't starting Baker. They didn't want to hear it, and it cost them the playoffs. So, yes. guys, I don't like this topic in a sense because it makes me talk negatively about some good football men in Case Keenum and Colt McCoy. Case Keenum's been on six teams. He's good with one of them for one season. Colt McCoy's been around forever. The rap on Colt McCoy is you can win with Colt McCoy. You give him great defense and right. You can win. We got a Ferrari we just drafted. Yeah. Be very careful saying, no, it's not his job because most likely he's the most talented, best quarterback on the team. I think what's interesting is when Hugh Jackson came out last year, it was almost like a sense of pride. Like, Terod is our quarterback. Mm -hmm. He is our Gruden's not saying that. Right. Good. He's not saying. I think this is still an open competition. Good. I still think it's in Gruden's best interest. Look, Gruden might not be in the coolest seat in the world to go with Haskins as well. Mm -hmm. I think to go with Haskins, not go with one of the veterans. But here's the thing. Credit to Jay Gruden, though, because if you're a coach that has had decent success and might be on the hot seat, the e to your point, the yes. easiest thing is to put a rookie Get him in there. there. Because it's it, it also hey. it extends your leash. It's like, you know what? The right. rookie just got here. Let me go ahead and put him in. It is really a risk to go out there and say, coach, is our guy, maybe Case is our guy, because if this doesn't work, he could be fired. I so I almost respect the fact that he's saying, you know what, it's not my best interest. It's the team's I love best it. players. Yeah. yeah, I respect it. It's that. early. We'll and see. And we'll see them play this week on Thursday. The Redskins are at Browns. That's a fun one. That'll be a fun game. We'll yeah. keep our eyes on everything going on. Again, this is a depth chart on August 5th. Right. So, Fluid. Yes, we will see Updates what happens coming. as it goes along. Up next on Good Morning Football on a Monday, which team has the best young core on offense in the NFL? Yeah, I say. I like these McCaffrey guys. makes a pretty good case. Yeah, he's got a core. I like that. He's got a core. He does. <laughs> he does. He's got a core on him, doesn't really he? really does. Look yes. at the glutes so, on that one. Core talk. So Sweet weird. mama baby. <laughs> Andrew Luck is going to miss a few days of practice in Indy. We've got a guy who spoke to the Colts quarterback, Michael